Wait, wait, wait. You locked that dude in the garage? I mean this with love, but see? You can be a little scary sometimes. Just remind me to never get on your bad side, okay? I meant in the future, but whatever. Hey, can I uh, ask you something? I was gonna ask you about your mom. Do you miss her? It's, well, it's been a while since, you know. Yeah, since then. I mean, you don't really talk about her much, see? You know, tell me if I'm getting too personal. I'm sorry, see? But why... Why do you think she did that? Why did she leave? Have you, you know, heard from her lately? Sorry, Z. If you ever want to talk about that or 86, you know I'm here for you. So, you know how I've been working on this little construction project? Yeah, you mind helping me with that? I could use a little manpower. Zeke, come on. K and Z, building stuff together. Nice. Like I said before, it's gonna be a ramp. I know it doesn't look like it. That's why I need help. Bad. I'll hand you some planks. Mind nailing them? See, you're scaring me again. Yeah, well, the hammer's over there. Here we go. Think of it as therapy. Uh, not that you need it. Two by fours incoming! Getting started. Halfway there. Keep channeling your uh, rage. Almost done. Keep going. Okay, let's stop there. Wouldn't want your arm to fall off or anything. You're not bad with a hammer, actually. Oh my god, Z. So, so scary. Well, that was fun. Yeah, literally. But I gotta run, alright? Gotta help my parents out with something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, Z. I think... I think you're ready to hear the truth, okay? Or at least, I'm ready to tell it to you. Meet me tonight, at the top of my building. I'll unlock the door for you. The first day I met you You were so sweet And meeting you was like a dream come true you swept me off my feet And now every day I'm blessed And in my heart I feel I kiss you lips up things A thousand reasons To stay right by your side The way you make me feel Touch the sky Baby Tell me you always
Attention, Black Brigade propaganda has been on the uptick in recent days. Don't be fooled. Thank you. Nice, you came. Didn't think you were, Z. Do you wanna sit? Maybe I wanted to keep it for myself. Kinda selfish, I guess. Sometimes I come up here to think. Sometimes not to think at all. It's good for that, too. Oh man, for real. You see the horizon there? That's my favorite part. Yeah, and peaceful, though I know it isn't. Listen, Z, I got some things I need to tell you. First off, we need to talk about 86. But I'm your friend. I know it hurts to try to remember. You're scared, but I'm here. I got your back, Z. No, Z. It's important. You can't always be running from 86 like this. You gotta face the truth. Look, I can't imagine what it was like. The explosions, the falling rock, the screams. But it didn't go down the way you think. The brigades didn't cause the collapse. It was the government. You know this. But you don't want to believe it. Stop!
Your memories got tangled in their lies. Look, I'll show you. Detonate the explosives now. Uh, forgive me, Sarah. Sorry to do this to you. But I gotta tell you something else. And I don't think you're gonna like it. Zoe. It's about that guy you saw me talking to. John. He's not a family friend. He's... A black brigade. Yeah, I thought maybe you figured it out. Uh, I don't know. Maybe they're helping us. But they expect something from us too. I don't know if we can trust them. They want us to get a file from Tyrax Palace. Yeah, that proves the brigades weren't behind the peak collapse. The government, Tyrak was. Yeah, and why I'm interested in that palace model. Maybe it could help my parents and me. The deal is, if we can get the file for this guy Robert, they'll help us get out of the country. <sighs> I was scared, all right? You're the minister's daughter, Z. I, I didn't want to lose you. I don't know. I 
I just know I had to tell you. It was killing me. Can we talk about this, Z? Please. Way to go, Kaido. Might have just lost another best friend. Today's date is May 4th. Let us make this the best day we possibly can. Thank you. Hello, I'm Sonia Sanchez. You're watching The Sonia Show for May 4th. The stage at Presidential Park has been prepped for Tyrax's big announcement later today. Many fans, like Gwen behind me, are already here, eagerly awaiting the words of their beloved president. Will Tyrak officially announce his candidacy for the election? I hope so. Of course, I'll be here live, covering the event as it unfolds. Gwen, you can stop waving now. And now, the weather. The weather is perfect as always. But a sandstorm will pass over White Sands in the next 24 hours. And it's picking up strength, with reported wind speeds already reaching up to 100 miles per hour. Meteorologists, or maybe just myself, have named it Sandstorm Sonia. Of course, The Sonia Show will also keep you updated on Sandstorm Sonia developments. I'm Sonia Sanchez, and this has been The Sonia Show for May 4th. When stop. Reminder, if you see any possible brigade activity, report it at once. Thank you. John? You're not supposed to come today. Kaido, do you copy? I had a feeling. Good thing I got these emergency walkies so that I could always annoy you, right? Yeah, well, to be honest, I'm still mad and confused. You made me think about 86, and then you revealed, well, you know what? It's a lot to process. Well, thanks for saying that. But like I said, I'm still not sure how I feel about all this. You're putting me in a tough spot, man. I guess you're wondering why we're not having this combo in person? I'm grounded. Again. Dude, after we had our talk, Adam caught me sneaking back into my room. Been grounded ever since. It's 
cool. My dad wants to talk to me before he goes to the park anyway. I feel a lecture coming on. Meet me at my place later. I'm grounded, but I can still sneak you in. Later, man. Over. Get over here, young blood. Look, we got ourselves a situation. Yeah, well, it isn't. Intel says Tyrak knows there are black brigades in White Sands. You didn't tell anybody about us, did you? Tell me the truth now. What? Who? You told the minister's daughter? She better not have. Parents Keisters are on the line. Look, young blood, the situation being what it is, your parents gotta grab the file tonight before the cops goes in. Well, we don't have a choice. Not if you and your parents want to help us. Here, the code's for the safe that we promised you. Don't let this fall into the wrong hands. Kid, there's something you gotta know. It's about Robert. He's... Tyrak's about to make his big announcement. I hope it's to say he's at death's door. Remember, tell your parents it's gotta be tonight. I'll pick you up at the spot, okay? So long, kid. First things first, I need to set things right with Z. I could take you in for a comment like that. But I won't. My shift's almost over. You just head on back to the dorms. All right? That's a good little worker. OK, now that he's gone. Uh, hi, I'm here. I don't know. What you said on the rooftop? You kept the truth from me. I, uh, I, I guess you did. But I have my doubts about the government being what you say it is. You sound like a nutball conspiracy theorist. No offense, but it wouldn't be the first time. Uh, yeah. But, Big A, true love comes around only once in this lifetime. Have you told her how you feel? Yeah, right, Steve. This is Adam you're talking to. Hello? You say something, Steve? Yeah, I'm saying you gotta let her know, brother, before it's too late. 
Fuck! Dude, I think we're picking up Adam and Steve's convo. Our frequencies must be mixing up. You get the feeling someone's listening in, Adam? I do, actually. Gonna change the frequency. So long, suckers! Oh, we lost them! Okay, we have to hear the rest of this convo. Adam's in love. We gotta find out with who. Yeah, well, you know, suck it up. Zoe needs her hot goss. writing her poems and fan letters, but I don't think she reads them. That's them! Eh, uh, not to be graphic, but she wipes with fan letters. That's what I hear anyway. Oh, Jesus! They're back again. So darn rude. Hey, whoever you are, let Steve and I talk in peace. Changing the frequency again. Ciao, losers! Me too. And I think I like it. Officer Campbell speaking. What's your emergency? I don't like my neighbor. That's not really a crime, ma'am. You can't arrest him? Afraid not, ma'am. Look, I'll give it to you straight, because that's how I roll. That's it! You gotta confess! Tell her! Stop beating around the bush! Yeah, right. Me, Adam Kopchak, tell Sonia Sanchez I love her? Forget about it! Oh, poor, poor Adam. Say it yourself first, Big A. Say... I love you, Sonia. I, uh, love you, Sonia? Yeah, like the kid said, here's the deal. If you don't believe it, she sure as hell won't. <clears throat> I love you, Sonia Sanchez! Hell yeah! Now that's the love I believe in. It's her! Come on, you got this, big dog. <laughs> Who the F are you? Uh, I'm Adam. I, I just want to say, I really love what you do. Well, bye. Oh, I love her so much. <laughs>
Four checkers in a row wins, okay? I don't understand how anybody could love Sonya. I mean, you not really. Me. And meeting you was like a dream come true. You swept me off my feet. And now every day I'm blessed. <laughs> Listen to you. I feel I kiss your lips a hundred times. A thousand reasons. Okay, hear me out. On the small chance that Adam and Sonia actually become a couple, they should have one of those couple names. Know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, guilty as charged. I went up to cheat. Another one? So, I've been thinking about what you said on the roof. About the file. Look, I want to help you get it. I mean, I'm not gonna actually break in. I doubt your parents would be cool with that anyway. But I can help you with the layout of the place. Yeah, seriously. If the file actually exists, big if. I can learn the truth about Tyrak, the government, my dad. And if it doesn't, then I get the satisfaction of proving you wrong. Which, you know, probably are. There's just one thing you've got to promise me. If the file really exists, I want to leave White Sands with you and your parents. It's dangerous, but it's dangerous for you and your parents too. Besides, we always said we were going to leave White Sands together. That big road trip we've been planning for. This could be our chance. It is, and it isn't. Kaido, if that file exists, I'm coming with you. End of discussion. Then it's settled. Tonight? What? Fine. Now let's get to work. So yeah, as you can see, I found the toy Steve was telling you about. Steve wasn't lying. Tyrak gave these as a weird welcoming gift to all Villa residents. It was in a cardboard box. Adam helped me find it. Dude, it's Adam. I'm guessing that passage leads to the safe. Tyrak's office is nearby. So it would make sense. But, you know, I can't say for sure. Daddy's office was off limits when I babysat Colton. Yeah, that's your way in. No doubt about it. I'm guessing that passage leads to the safe. Tyrak's office is nearby, so it would make sense. But, you know, I can't say for sure. 
Daddy's office was off limits when I babysat Colton. Attention workers, a search is currently being conducted in Tyrex Square. Avoid interfering with law enforcement agents. Thank you. What's going on? Move along! Nothing to see here! Uh oh! Uh, Kaito! Stick around, okay? What's happening? Here I said. Kaito, what did I say? Officer, my husband's down there. What seems to be the problem? No problem. Just doing a search, man. Kaito, please. Just following up on a tip that there are some sympathizers in the community. Oh, I think you know what I'm talking about. Like I said, we got a tip. We're just following up on it. If you're not sympathizers, then you have nothing to worry about. But we'll let the inspectors sort that out. Oh, speak of the devil. Here they are now. Separate the kid, Rick. Let's have a word with him. Ah. Search the kid, Rick. Looky here, a walkie-talkie and some kind of note. Put it with the rest. Quiet! Look, we found all this stuff on you, or in that little apartment of yours. We're gonna need some explanations. Now.
got this because you listen to a specific broadcast, don't you? Yeah, the Black Brigade broadcast. When you could be listening to GNN? This one's on the road to immorality, Rick. And he's driving 100 miles per hour. What are those numbers anyway? 41186? I know those numbers. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's Colton's birthday. April 11th, 1986. Why the hell do you have Colton's birthday on a piece of paper? Oh, then you can answer this question. Oh yeah, this one should be easy then, Rick. <laughs> what does Colton like most in this world? Hmm. Yeah, that's right. Colton loves his dad most, as he should. Ah, a leaflet for Flores. I'm gonna puke. Smart, kid. Real smart. Trouble is, I don't buy it. Yeah, that makes two of us, Rick. Use that to talk to the brigades? Is that it? Practicing to be a cop? I don't know, Rick. Something feels... off. Yeah, something just... <laughs> doesn't smell quite right. How are things looking with the kid over there? Pretty sure the kid's a BB. We just don't have enough to bring him in. But give us time. I see. Peach fuzz. How about some water? This look like your son, Officer Campbell? Stay out of this. I hope we don't have to, kid. Zip it. Panic. Now we're letting the parents go. They've paid the fine. Now let the kid go, too. Over. Let the kid go. What? Already? Get out of here, kid. But we'll be watching you and your parents. Understand? So long, Petria. Here we go.
Hanzu, he's waking up. How are you feeling? Your father and I will be fine. Don't worry about us. Yes, between the fine and everything they could find in the apartment. But it could be worse. We, we could all be in prison right now, Kaito. job, the file. We will all have to wait. This family is just more important. That's what we want too. But it's just not a good time to try, Kaito. Just, just get some rest, okay? And here, you've got to be more careful, Kaito. Are you there? Over. Are you okay? Are you sure? You don't sound so good. What's going on? What? What? No. Well, you believe me, right? Good. I wouldn't rat you out like that, okay? Look, if you want to talk, you know where to find me. Otherwise, uh, I think Tyrex about to make his announcement, whatever it is. Yeah, of course. Attention, for your safety, police agents have been dispatched in the park. Thank you. Are they booing Tyrak's announcement? Break! I'm gonna need those bonbons stat. I repeat, bonbons stat. Over! Ooh. Gonna have to ask you to move along. Young Colton is deep in reflection. I'll handle this one, Frank. Why don't you just run along and play? I can't, Colton. I'm your bodyguard. Always have to be the... Don't you afraid. What am I doing, you ask? Well, I'm contemplating father. Yes, I would contemplate him in person. But father tells me this is annoying. Alas, I must use this tasteful representation by proxy. 
Now, if you'd excuse me, I have some further reflecting to do. for Tyrax's announcement. Any idea what he's going to say? That would be amazing, yeah. And very unexpected. <laughs> Everyone knows Tyrax's first term was magisterial. What was your favorite moment? Yes, he has created this oasis here in White Sands, hasn't he? Thank you, Tyrax. Okay. So, last question. If you could send a message to Tyrak right now, what would it be? Know what, Dan? I think we'll edit that one out. Put in some pics of Colton or the wall. A little voiceover on top. It'll be good. Okay, last thing. Would you mind singing one last time? I'm sure that first time was an anomaly. Tyrak, ooh, baby. Oh, my lord. Nope, no anomaly. And that's a wrap. 
Congratulations. You are the worst singer I've ever heard, but that interview was great. Now we'll take a photo so you can remember this day for the rest of your life. Dude, you did it! Whoa! Crowd sounds really angry. Anyway, well done. Challenge accepted and destroyed. But you know, saying what you did, that was risky, man. Zoe, I have ice cream! Oh, that's, uh, Adam. I, uh, gotta go. Ice cream, dude. Hey, you sure you want to stick around for Tyrex announcement? Suit yourself. See you later, okay? Just don't do anything stupid, please. Well, they tried to sabotage this day, but they failed. Citizens, I'm here today to announce my candidacy for the election. The brigades can't hide from me. Traitors! For a future without fear. A future without brigades. Vote Tyrant! Thank 